Because in Japan, I'm in Kota. Today, I'm in Akihabara. So I'm gonna be showing you must go spots here. I'm getting people's recommendations on the street. Through this video, you will be able to know where to go in Akihabara. I'm at Retro Game Camp. This is my recommendation. You can find nostalgic and classic games that you might not be able to find in your own country anymore. Let's go inside. There are lots of Famicom cartridges and various game consoles, making you feel like you've gone back to your childhood. Well, I didn't play Famicom. Do you feel nostalgic about it? They even sell Pikachu-themed game consoles and nostalgic Tamagotchis. Look at this, this GameCube! GameCube is so nostalgic for me. I used to play this ga these games. Um, it's so nostalgic. Nostalgic. Yabai. Yeah. Yabai. 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 Nostalgic. So nostalgic. Mega Drive. Right? Mega Drive. How do you say in English? Mega Drive. Yeah. Mega Drive. Drive. Mega Drive. Mega Drive. It's so nostalgic, guys. You should come here to get these stuff. What is your favorite game? Super Mario 64. All right. No, it's Resident Evil. Eh? One more. Resident Evil. What is that? Resident Evil. Like a zombie biohazard sort of game. <laughs> <laughs> I played on the Xbox. Ah, Xbox, yeah. OK, so how do you like this shop? It's really good. It's a lot of retro games here. Yeah. A lot of stuff to pick from. So it's fantastic. We're trying to find an old console that we can play games on. Okay. Yeah, having a look. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what is your Not too sure yet. Maybe the Nintendo 64? Nintendo 64? Something retro. So in your country, can you guys get these like nostalgic games for in your country? Nothing really retro. Only the new stuff. Okay. Yeah. The new stuff. Okay. Yeah, latest one like the Switch. You don't really find any like old games. Okay. So it's really different here. Okay. In your country, Australia? Australia, yeah. Okay, right. Arigatou gozaimashita. Thank you very much. Arigatou <laughs> So when we were working around Akihabara and I found Pokemon game vending vending machine. Yay! Okay, let's try this. Like, I put the studio, I put 500 yen, like 500 yen, and put it here. Put it in the machine. Pikachu! Okay. I will tap this one, okay. I don't know. I, I like Bangiras. It's a Bangiras square. I got this one, but I'm not a big fan of Pokemon. Poke I'm not a big fan of Pokemon. Yadon, de show? Gambra, de show? All of them are so, maji, so this weak, this weak, so weak. This. Hi, I'm at Mandrik in Akihabara. So this is my recommendation because you will, you can find manga, comics, trading card, um, figures, um, anything, anything that you want. <laughs> okay, let's go inside. From the first to the eighth floor, there are plenty of collectors' items, making it a great recommendation for enthusiasts and collectors. Wow, there are lots of Sailor Moon figures. Oh, I've never watched before. There is a full of second-hand toys and old books. So even if you are just browsing or looking for something specific, you can enjoy it like a museum. There are many types of card games, comics, and old books sold at great prices. This place might be a paradise for you. Next, I'm going to interview Japanese people about their recommended places. On the street, mates stand outside in the cold trying to attract customers. When we film them, they hide their faces. Why do you think they do that? あ、<笑><笑> 
結構ありますね、うん、あの二郎系みたいな豚骨系もありますし豚骨系が多いのかなやっぱりこっちはわかりました二郎っていうとワールドこのボリューミーのあるもやしがバーッとバンってやつ感じですよねはいそうですね好きなアニメは好きなアニメブレイワン<笑>はいなってましたブレイワンブレイワンですああオッケーそれだけ人気のアニメなんですか始まったばっかりですねまだああそうなんですねそれ外国でも人気なんですかねいやーちょっと外国はわかんないですけど、うん、まあ今新しいアニメでまあ何か面白いものがあるかって言われたらえっ、ー、とブレイバーンを出しますね僕はブレイバーンですねブレイバーンブレイバーンですね勇者爆発ブレイバーンわ<笑><笑>かりました多分あの外国人の方多分知ってる方多分いるかもしれないんで、はい、おすすめの秋葉原でお店とかありますよく絶対行くようなお店絶対はあんまないんですけど昨日行ったちょっとシーシャ屋さん新車屋さん秋葉原の煙中毒っていうところに、まあ、昨日行かせてもらって結構楽しめたなんかコンセプトはアニメとかそういうのは秋葉原に関係あるんですかそれともまあコ,コンカフェに近い感じですかねあ,あのメイドさんみたいのがやまあいるんですけどまあ実際 C シャツだけなのでまあそんな接待とかそういうのもないので。店員さんがメイドさんみたいな感じってことですよね要するにそうですねああそうなんですねわかりましたではありがとうございましたはいありがとうございましたはい、I'm at Kemuri Chudoku which is made shisha bar I've got a recommendation from the guy on the street and then he really loves this shisha bar so okay let's go and see yeah come in Lovely maize belly come customers with delicious shisha, offering over 150 flavors, including non nicotine options. It's so sweet, it's, it's so sweet. It tastes like it. Honey. これってハニーだよね。あのなんだっけハニーあのあハニーあのピーチのあのマンゴー。これなんか very fruity。I really like it。Making it perfect for shisha beginners, you can enjoy shisha starting from 3,000 yen. It's a curious made shisha, hey? I'm gonna give them four out of five because I really like the place. They have variety of shisha flavors and drinks. But I wish maze would be more interactive with us. So, but it's still a really good place. So I highly recommend you guys to visit Kemuri Chudak. I hope you enjoyed this video. Akihabara is a really good place for people who love anime and games and Japanese entertainment. And You can find many things to do in here and you will spend whole day in Akihabara. No, I, ca I can't do that, but you can if you like anime and such a Japanese stuff. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to How's It to Japan and book my tour in Asakusa and by hopping in Shinjuku. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!